Hey Wargamers and welcome to Gaming with the Mountain. I have Jake over here. Hi. All the way from Australia to play a 2,250 point battle report of Dark Eldar versus Space Wolves. Rawr. Right now let's look at our armies and the table. Here's my Dark Eldar force. My HQ choice is a Court of the Archon. It has five Slith, one Leman, and two Medusae. They're going to be riding around in my Tantalus that has the Flickerfield, Night Shields, and Splinter Racks. For troops, I have three units of five Cabalites with a Blaster inside a Raider, sorry, a Venom with an extra Splinter Cannon upgrade. Two units of Cabalites with a single Splinter Cannon upgrade. Those two units of Cabalites are each riding in their own Raider with a Dark Lance, Splinter, or sorry, uh, splinter Racks, and Night Shields. For Elites, I have two units of Trueborn. One of them has four Shredders and upgraded with the Deacon, the actual champion for the unit. He's actually my Warlord. His Warlord trait was just basically Rage, nothing good. And he's in a Venom, or they're in a Venom, with a Shurkin, sorry, the Splinter Cannon upgrade. The other Trueborn squad has just two Dark Lances, and they're in a Venom as well with a Splinter Cannon. Now, there is two Blasters in there. I thought I had more regular rifles than I did, so they're just proxied in for regular guys. Fast Attack has six Reavers with two Cluster Keltrops and two Blasters. Two Razorwing Jet Fighters with Dark Lances, Splinter Cannon, Night Shields, and no missile upgrades, just the regular missiles. Heavy Support has a Void Raven Bomber, upgraded to have Dark, sorry, what are the, oh, I forget the name of the weapon. The, the Dark, Dark Hole, Dark Scythe, Dark Scythe. They're Strength 8, Small Blast, AP2, Lance, Shots. Uh, Night Shields as well, and no missiles were paid for on this flight, this flyer. <laughs> and finally, I have a Ravager with three Dark Lances and Night Shields. All that makes up for 2,250 points of Dark Eldar. Jake's Space Wolf Army. Uh, for HQ, I have brought Herald Deathwolf, and he's got Saga of the Wolfkin for his Warlord trait. And he'll be riding with three Thunderwolf Cavalry, all with Storm Shields, and one has a Frost Axe. My other HQ choice, I did bring a level 2 Rune Priest, and the Psychic Powers are there, so we bought Fury of the Wolf Spirits, Murderous Hurricane, and Primaris Power is Living Lightning. Uh, troop choice, I have brought a squad of 10 Grey Hunters with a Plasma Gun and the Wolf Pack Leader with a Storm Bolter and Frost Sword. The other one, same again, 10 Grey Hunters with a Plasma Gun and the Wolf Pack Leader has two Wolf Claws. I have brought 12 Blood Claws with a Pack Leader with Wolf Claws again. Uh, that's pretty much for the upgrades and I'm hoping them to chuck them in the transport. And that transport being a Land Raider Crusader. I uh, brought a squad of Terminators, uh, three Storm Bolters, one Power Fist, three wo uh, two Wolf Claws. Uh, the Flamer has a Power Fist and the Wolf, uh, the Pack Leader with two Wolf Claws. Another Elite choice, I decided to bring Murder Fang for some fun and he'll be coming in with Drop Pod. Fast Attack choice, since I've got the Warlord trait for Wolfkin, I decided to bring a squad of 11 Puppies. Uh, for heavy support, I brought a squad of six Longfangs. The Longfang Ancient have given a Flamer. I've got one Heavy Plasma and four Rocket Launchers, and I have upgraded them with Flak. And finally, for the last heavy support, I brought the Stormfang Gunship. And that's me with 1247 points and uh, just a bit of variety. I didn't want to bring any formations this time, and yeah, just a General this is of everything. Only 1250 points? Oh, sorry. <laughs> 2247. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Oh, it's half price. And yeah, now um, we'll go to the table. Let's see what we're doing over there. And here is the table we're going to be playing on today. We are playing Spoils of War. That's the scenario where you can score your opponent's objective numbered cards. We're all going to all training there. Here we got Ruins, Crater. We're splitting the difference on this one for Ruins and Crater, calling it a 5 up save. 
That'll have battlements, but not actually a bastion. Just some impassable terrain buildings here. Uh, another ruined land raider over here. That there is just my phone. That's not terrain. We got a ruin over here. Some trees. Markers are two, four, five, three in the bastion, one on the ground, and we have six hiding over there. This is my side of the table. This is Jake's. I got first turn, so I'm gonna deploy right now. I have deployed everything but my flyers and my jet bikes. Cabalites and a raider, cabalites and a raider, a ravager, cabalites and a venom. Nope, that's actually my shredders in the venom. Trueborn with the blast, or sorry, the dark lances, cabalites, Court of the Archon in my tantalus, and two more cabal units with the blasters in venom. And across the table, we have long fangs on the battlements. We have some Grey Hunters behind the building, a Land Raider in behind that, and more Grey Hunters over here with your an objective. That's it, it's all deployed. Rest is in reserve, or a Flyer Reserve. And we're going to turn one. Before we go to turn one, are you still the initiative? Yeah, I'll try. I'm going to edit this clip out if you actually still the initiative. <laughs> <laughs> good, good, I don't think this is out. <laughs> all right, Dark Eldar, turn one. I'm going to draw my three cards. It's going to be Hungry for Glory! Mark, oh, I gotta it, that's marker 11. Or card 11, I'll look it up in a second. And hold the line. Card number 11 for the Dark Eldar is Take Them Alive. Score one victory point if I just kill something in the assault phase, or if I kill an independent character, uh, I score D3 points. Starting with the squad over here, I'm gonna move my Venom up six, and then disembark my Cavalades. And disembarking my Trueborn with the Dark Lances over on the roof. I'm gonna move my Tantalus full. Well, not the full 12, but more than six. The guys inside are off the snap flare. Nothing's really in range of their 18 inch range guns, so I feel comfortable moving up a little bit farther. I'm gonna move a Venom with Cabalites over here. And this one, whoa, the guy fell out over here. This is Venom. It's gonna go and hop down. My Reavers are gonna just jump on forward some. And again, I have forgot to roll. Drugs. Yes. And my combat drugs is gonna be a three. I think it's initiative. So they are initiative seven bikers. Uh, the Venom here is gonna, sorry, the Raider here is gonna stay put. Venom is going to jump up here. All right, we got one Raider, gonna move to here. So my Ravager can take his spot. That concludes my movement phase and I'm gonna see if I can destroy the Long Fangs with a bunch of poison shots. We're starting over here with the Venom and the Long Fangs. Two Splinter Cannons into the Long Fangs, hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. With a three up power armor save. How many we get? We get, ooh, three off the hop. Two, three. Losing three missile launchers. Then four splinter rifles snap firing into them, hitting on sixes. Wounding on fours for one more three up save. Makes it. Well, this Venom is gonna fire into the guys on all right, so I kind of cheat a little bit. Uh, I, technically, only the one barrel underneath, like the barrel underneath can't see. So this this Venom fired and that Venom fired with their top guns and that's it. So this one's done shooting as well. So I don't have to fix anything. Guys inside are gonna fire or snap fire their rifles. Hitting on sixes, wounding on fours, no damage. All right, I'm gonna go into my Trueborn's Venom. Both guns could see up there. So we're gonna fire all 12 shots into those. I wanna call them Havocs, Long Fangs. Long Fangs. Hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. Three, three up saves. Made them all. Next Venom over. Same squad. Hitting on threes. Yeah, there's was a good one. Wounding on fours. Ooh, that should be pretty good. Trays, better than average, please. Ooh, just one. There goes the Sergeant. 
My Tantus gonna fire next, gonna fire its two heavy cannons into the Marines on the ground over there. Hitting on threes. Wounding on threes, straight five. Cover's gonna go back and forth over here. The first guy's gonna four up cover for being in the ruins there. The next guy's gonna get cover because I'm shooting through my own venom at five up, and then back up to four up, and then five up, and I don't know how many more I can see after that. So, after that I can see one more with a five up. So we got a four up, dead. We got a five up, dead. <laughs> four up, good, four up, good, four up, dead. Oh, realizing that's the pack leader? Good, to have a lookout, sir, that one. He's good, kills the next guy over. This Venom is gonna fire his top Venom cannon, sorry, Splinter cannon, into these last two Iron Fangs. Hitting them on threes. Long, yeah. long Fangs. Long Fangs. Wounding them on fours. Ooh, two. Ah, they're good. Snap firing his Dark Lance into those Marines, because why not? He misses. My Ravager is gonna fire three Dark Lances into the Rhino, or the Land Raider. Hitting on threes. We got one hit. Glancing on fours with his Lance. Does nothing. This cannon from inside the, for the Raider itself is gonna fire the Dark Lance. Hitting on threes. It hits. Looking for a four to glance. We do nothing. That's going to conclude my shooting. I want to move nothing else far, farther forward and do no more shooting. So we just have a morale test for the long things at leadership nine. See if they run. Now they're good. And we have a morale test over here for the Ray Hunters, and they're good too. End of my turn, I'm going to score hold the line. And this is still something in the assault phase. I wanted to start it, but I'd rather just start the challenge one first. So I'll discard this one this turn. But it stays there until I could. Points. Turn one for Space Wolves, we have three cards drawn for objectives. Secure objective three. Ooh, you got her. Domination, D3 victory points of control, objective markers on the table. Oh, that's, that's a hard one. <laughs> yeah, and assassinate. Assassinate, well my only character is in this raider, or so this Venom. Yeah, it's the only character I brought. Land Raiders, and then on forward. Pivot. Pivot. And uh, the Grey Hunters over here, they're gonna run an hide. Hoping to survive another turn and I'm not liking all those poison shots, so sure. I'm just gonna... <laughs> Grey Hunters in the ruins here to move through cover. One more die. Mm, I'll take that one. Then. You take the five? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no, I'll go with the one. Well, that ends the movement phase, we're going on to the psychic phase. How many warp charges are we gonna get? Five. Going with Murder's Hurricane. How many warp charges you can try to expend? So warp charge two spell to cast. So I got four and three. I'm gonna do them both. So this one, being a big large blast, I'll do only three. Three dice, okay. Any more two four pluses? Failed. Ooh, I like that. And then All right, so we have Fury of the Spirit Wolves. Fury of the Spirit, Spirit Wolves. Okay. Warp charge two. Getting it. I'm gonna use all five of my dice. Try and stop it. No, not a, just one. So you're targeting the squad here. They're gonna yeah. jink. They're gonna jink. So what's the first attack? Uh, I'll go the Fury of Freki, so Assault 4, and then Strength 6, AP nothing. Alright, hitting on 2's I'm assuming? Uh, <laughs> Alright, he's only, let's just go 4, hitting on 3's. One. 1. 1 hit, what's the strength? Strength 6. Wounding me on 2, uh, 2 still. Uh, we got a wound with a 3 up jank. Yeah, we're good. Next shot, 2 shots, hitting on 3's. 1 hit. Wounding on threes? Ugh. No. But you made him a jank, that's the thing. That's a wrap. Shooting phase. Starting with the long things. Where are you putting the shots? Where's the first shot going? They have split fire, so you can target two different things. Hmm. All right, I am not gonna jank. I'm gonna risk this. A single shot from the rocket into the Tantalus. Hitting on a three. Glancing on a four. There's a pen. Five up and vulnerable save. No, the jink would have saved it. Okay, I am open topped. So you can blow it up on a th six. On a six? Don't roll a six. Also, you've made them mad. <laughs> Don't roll you've made six. them so mad. <laughs> One and six, I throw the camera across the room. Ah! Across oh! the room! Oh! No! 
Well done. You, you blew up my tantalus. <laughs> How far does it explode? Yeah, it's getting both of them. So he glanced him on a six. Oh, yes. Glance that one on a six? No. no. All right, let's remove the tantalus. <sighs> the guy who always gets one-shotted. I have to start jinking. If he lives. And please forgetting I have guys inside that I kind of wanted to move next turn. <laughs> uh, I risked it. I stand by my decision. Let's see if we can wound all these guys. Wounding the squad inside on fives. All right, we got three wounds. All right, I'm gonna roll randomly who gets the damage here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We're rolling 11 and 12. So there's an 11. And 10. One, so LeMann takes the first one. Uh, she has no save. My bad, she has Papa's armor. Oh, she tanks it. So the next one is gonna go on number six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hits a slith, the red slith. Five up, I'm gonna roll that four. <laughs> five up armor. And five up fill no pain. He takes a wound. And the last one hits, oh, that's nine. That uh, hits him. Yep. So five up save. Five up fill no pain. No, he takes a wound too. Plasmakin is going for this Venom right here. Again, I'm not gonna jink. I think I have the firepower to risk this. Does it get hot? Nope. nope. All right, go right for the top of this Venom. Where's she gonna go? She's gonna go three, three inches. inches. Which will still hit me. All right, three to glance. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. You pen me. Pen. Okay. Invulnerable save of five up. Aha! Okay. Open top in AP2. Plus two to the chart. Oh, jeez. <laughs> How far does it explode? <laughs> Three inches. Glances him on a six. Nope. Two wounds over here on threes. Two wounds. Five plus save. Nope. Kills two. Matantlas gave you first blood. <gasps> Yay! Both hurricane bolters are going to fire into my raider over here, who is going to jink. Six shots hitting on threes. Twin linked, because only half of them hit. And that's everything hitting, so we have six chances to glance on the sixes. You know the sixes. You got a glance. Three up, jink. He's fine. Made it. And power the machine spirit, the assault cannon, into my ravager, who's also going to jink. Hitting on threes. Twin linked. Glancing on fours. What rending. Is rending to be in the... No, no, nothing, but you made him jink. That is a big deal. Mm. All right, this squad of Grey Hunters is going to fire into the last Raider here, who's going to make them jink as well. So let's do the bolt type guns. Yep, eight pulses. Hitting on threes without the scatter die. <laughs> and we got some hits. Glancing on sixes. We got one, three up jink. Nope, taking a hollow point. Two storm bolters hitting on threes. And glancing on sixes. We got another one. Three up jink. Made that one. Then we got a plasma gun. Does she get hot? And the shoot as well. Oh! oh three up armor. Oh, you're good. That's it for whatever. I've and oh, turn one. Are you scoring anything? Uh, Domination, you can say no. Three, which I've got. Yup. Assassinate. He's hiding in there still. He's hiding in there. Domination, I'm not going to get every objective marker. So I'm going to discard it. Yeah, one. makes sense. So going on to turn two for the Dark Eldar. Oh. Turn two. Oh, before that, the reserves. Okay, these are my two Razor Wing Jet Fighters coming on a three plus. One is. And my Void Raider from Bomber coming on a three plus. It's coming in. All right, cards. We got marker number five. Marker number five. Oh, no. I definitely gotta go contest that. And <sighs> fly on. So in the moon phase, obviously I gotta contest that objective or at least get to it. I think the jet bikes can get there comfortably, but everything here has to clear that squad out. And I still need to knock this squad out to knock out at least one Skyfire missile launcher. So that means these guys have to jump back onto terrain so they can see to get all their guns on range. Uh, this Venom is gonna go to here and risk getting immobilized for extra shots. Totally immobilized. No, it's a one, Never mind. All good. 
Venom with my captain. Uh, uh, which way do I want to aim? Oh, do I want to? Uh, I uh, uh. It should be enough. It should be enough. And These two are gonna support. You can hold no, back a bit. And this he's gonna he's gonna get like that. He'll stay here. And I'm gonna three on him. This one's gonna jump up. Take, whoa, drop my minis. Like that. So I'm gonna put another test. 36 shots. No, this is a splash surface. Oh, yeah. This one will end up going that way. And go to there. Change of mind, I forgot about the land raider. Let's stay over here. <laughs> move through cover for my core of the Archon. <coughs> we're gonna move to here. We're gonna move, we're all snap firing, so we might as well go full ballistics, or full speed. There. Uh, I'm gonna move them up a bit. And we're just gonna, adjust. now nah, we're gonna stay put. My jet bikes aren't gonna do, well, they'll, they'll move, ah, they're not gonna do anything. In the stream <laughs> phase, they're gonna turbo boost and land over here and get on that objective right after we clear out everything out of the way. So that's it. Uh, actually, I might as well move them. No, there's no reason to move them. That's it, we're going on to the shooting phase. Starting here with this Venom, we're gonna, um, yeah, I think I'm gonna start, yeah, starting with this Venom here. Sorry, I was rethinking my strategy. Firing the long things, so we can knock out that missile launcher. It's the most important right now. Hitting on threes, wounding on fours, and three up armor. Ooh, we get him. Snap firing the blaster inside, hitting on a six. Nope. Snap firing the rifles inside, hitting on sixes. Nothing. Venom over here is going to fire into him as well. Looking for threes to hit, fours to wound. And, oh, okay, we got four saves at three up for that plasma gunner. We kill the last long thing. Yeah, we got him. Moving on to the Razor Wing Jet Fighter. We're gonna fire all four of the missiles at the squad on the ground. All right, aiming right there. The first missile's gonna go hmm. far, far away, six inches away. Gets absolutely nothing. The next missile, direct hit. Third missile is going over just two inches, hitting eight more, and the last missile, direct hit, another 11. 30 hits, wounding on twos. Looking for three up armor. I think we can knock out here. Not a lot, actually. One, two. <laughs> Not a single one. Good thing it wasn't Terminators, so killing five of those Marines. Snap firing the splinter cannon. Hitting on sixes, wounding on fours. One more three up save. Totally good. Snap firing the dark lances, no hits. I'm gonna snap fire all the dark lances together. Uh, they're all in the front arc. Um, none of them are gonna get a save, so I can do them all together. So three, four, five dark lances into the land raider, hitting on sixes. Two, glancing on fours, one pen. It's AP2, let's see what we can do. Just shaking. Crap. One of them does, it's fighting through trees. So I probably them separately, but too late. So They all go together, so we get cover. Five up, uh, and it's that one hall We could have done one, two. Nah, it's all right, I shouldn't have. I one who broke the rules, so I gotta punch myself. So, five up cover? Yep. Hey. Totally good, no damage. Dark Lance, Land Raider, hitting on a three. It hits, I'm gonna leave that dice there, it's a six. We're glancing on a four. We do nothing. At this point, I've made a mistake in my strategy. I made a, well, You, you kind of caught him. Caught him. Uh, Battleforge, so those are troops. They're gonna secure that objective. So when my Reavers get there, they're still gonna control the objective. Uh, I could have got this guy on it and had him secure, but I already fired him, so it's too late to turbo boost him. So I really gotta just clean them right out. That will make a difference, because now this guy's gonna have to fire onto them instead of instead of just firing at the Land Raider. So I'm gonna throw two blasts from the, I don't even know what you're called, Void, Ra Void Raven, <laughs> into the Marines. Um, All right, so the dark size, we're gonna go try as many as we can. Direct hit will get me four, and direct hit. The second one, 
is gonna get, oh, does it hit the, nah, not gonna hit the uh, Land Raider, will it? And doesn't get the Land Raider, so we just got four hits that are wounding on twos. Uh, the Librarian's in the back, so he won't get hit. And we have four Ruin saves, because AP2, so four of them. Two die. Cabalades in this Venom or Raider here. There's gonna flare in there. We have 10 shots with the, oh no. I have a cannon in there. So nine shots from the rifles into that squad, hitting on threes. Twin link because of splinter racks for no extra hits. Who wounding on fours for one wound. Three of armor, make it. Six shots from the cannon, hitting on threes. Twin link because of racks and wounding on fours. Three more, three ups. We gotta get them all, we need those points. We get one, still gonna be four left. Nine shots from this crew, hitting on threes with the rifles. Rerolling, wounding on fours. Oh no, wow. two more three up saves. I don't think I can knock them off. If I no, they're good. All right, so I moved, so the cannon only gets four shots. Oh, you know what, it's only 18 range. You wanna measure that for me? And it's just out, so no shots from the cannon. Looks like they're gonna be sitting there. I made a mistake over here last turn. Um, they had done no damage, but they should have done a morale test, which they would have failed, and then fell back. Seven inches. The raider down here is gonna fire two cannons into, uh, I'm gonna see if they fire the rifles first. Are they in range? No, nah, they're gonna be too far out, 24 inches. Yeah, way out. Yeah. So two cannons into those last three marines. Hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. Oh, get in my hand. Choose the wound. Three sides. I mean, what <laughs> I say? that wasn't even, I'm so confused. Oh. Oh, uh, cue the two regular guys. That will remove your objective secured. That'll help. And final Venom. He's gonna fire his six shots into the room piece. Priest, because he has nothing else to really shoot. I don't see a point to bring him else anywhere at the moment. So, hitting on threes. One cannon on top, wounding on fours. Four saves. Three up armor on that room priest. Takes a, a wound. wound. Last thing I'm gonna do on the shooting phase is I'm gonna turbo boost these jet bikes. All right, so thinking <laughs> about this whole thing, uh, even though I've, I've knocked off their objective secured, I can't actually score it this turn because that priest is in the way and I have nothing else left to shoot. He's got one wound left and I can't control that objective. None of my troops can get there fast enough. So if I turbo boost those jet bugs in behind and contest it next turn, his troops will just get on there and score it on his turn and get my two marker number fives. So I was thinking that he'd make a semicircle in front of the objective so he can't get the troops to it and you have to assault them. But if he assaults them, they're as good as dead. So I think, I think I have to contest those two points to you and try to maneuver for a better, I don't know, something for another, for another turn. Yeah, we'll lose that yes. And I'm gonna, yeah, shift them over slightly to prepare for what's gonna happen next turn. So I just, I was one wound short away from scoring two points, but I think I'm still in a pretty good position. So that ends my turn two. I'm gonna score nothing. And I am gonna discard, oh. Discard a five. I can't discard the fives, just part oh, of the scenario yeah. rules. I'm gonna discard this kill something in the assault phase. Because I don't think I can kill anything in the assault phase. So, next turn you'll score my two marker number fives. Turn two for the Space Wolves. What are we getting? Secure marker number four. four. Where's four? Right in the middle of everything. Oh, okay. My army's sitting on it. And a five. Oh, uh, no! <laughs> <laughs> well, you already got three points no matter what, just by doing nothing. Oh, wait, what would I... What do they do? <laughs> They're gonna get assaulted now while you're blood claws. I don't know what I was thinking. No, it's not blood claws, the truth. They have to. No, they don't. I didn't go over and contest it. I'm <laughs> I overthought and just. <laughs> I still hold it. <laughs> you still hold it. <laughs> I, I should... That's what the barrier was supposed to do. That's was exactly. There. I was. I... Oh well, there, there you go. I'm falling apart here, man. I'm falling apart. You killed my tantalus and you broke my brain. <laughs> uh, with my battalion, I can automatically pass a reserve oral with one of my troops that are out flanking. So the Herald and his squad are going to come in automatically. With the 
The Fenrisian Wolves? Yes. There we go, I got it. Are they coming on in a three plus? They're coming on. There's no Terminators. Are they coming on? They're coming on. Murderfang. Murderfang. He's uh -oh. coming on. Uh oh. And the flyer. Oh, oh, flyer's coming on. Oh, no. No, he's not coming on. That's a two. Okay, so just the actually scary things and no flyers yet. Outflanking, one twos over here. Uh, three fours over there, five six getting twos. This is for the. The wolves? Thunder wolves. This uh, this side. So, do you want to reroll that? Good senses, I will reroll that. Looking for anything but a one or two? Four. So, that's over there. Over there. Then the actual wolves? Yep. Yep. So, I'll reroll that. Uh, cute senses, I want to go that side. And I'll Anywhere you side. want, so that side. And that's it? Yep. All the wolves are all flanking over here. All right, murder fangs drop on. <laughs> I'm coughing. <laughs> I'm leaving it in. All right, they're trying to land right here. That's fine. Fair kid. Terminator captains had a deep strike right here and destroy my jet bikes. How far are they going to go? Uh, four inches back. Land Raider pivoted slightly and uh, disembarked the blood claws. Gray Hunter's going to move over. Try to get something in their line of sight. So, in this psychic phase, Jake has decided to skip it because he feels he's going to... I'm going to peril and he's going to explode. explode. And three points it is worth three points. So, yeah, I, I think I'll... Yeah, it's a smart move. <laughs> All right, so we're going on to the shooting phase. Gray Hunters are going to fire into my Razorwing Jet Fighter. It's going to jink. No. Bolt guns, eight shots, hitting on sixes. Three oh. hits. And these things are glancing on sixes. Okay. Nothing. Gun gets hot. Totally fine. Hits. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's, that's the thing, yeah. Terminator's going to fire into my jet bikes. Uh, I'm going to jink. Flamer's going first. Uh, hits two guys. It's heavy flamer. So wounds on threes. Two dead. Ignores my jink and ignores my armor. Three storm bolters now hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. Oh. Three wounds. Three up jink. Oh no, that's my three special guys too. And the room priest is gonna fire the last jet plate. He's hitting on threes. He's wounding on fours. Nothing. Murder things to go. He's gonna fire his heavy flamer into this yep. raider. So it hits D6 guys on the inside. Oh, wait a second. I have to go back a second. So you got three hits. I'm gonna go back to this for a second. Three jet bikes had died, had um, fill no pain of six plus. So the first one was a regular guy. Did he make his fill no pain? He did not. Then the two special ones, they're still dead. And the last one is alive. So we have one more regular jet biker on the field. Now back over here, the three flamers hits the guys on the inside, wounds them on twos. Ignores their armor, but at six up, feel no pain. Three die. And you can glance the vehicle on a five. Oh. No nothing. Storm boulders are firing the rear armor of my Ravager. Not gonna jink. Hitting on threes, glancing on sixes. Oh, 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 oh. so close, it's good. Sponsons from the Land Raider to fire into my Razor Wing here. That's rapid fire range, so 12 shots. Hitting on sixes. Twin linked. We got four hits so far. Just four hits. Oh, five hits, got another one. And looking for sixes to glance, my armor 10. Is he jinked? Yeah, he got jinked. Two glances. I'm gonna take two of these. Three of jink. Takes a hall point, he's done two. Power of the machine spirit, the running can into my Ravager. I gotta jink it. Hitting on threes. We got two hits. Twin linked. Just two hits. Looking for sixes of glance. Well, it's right. rending, so it'll be six of the pen, essentially. Nothing. Yeah, I was, uh, sorry, I, I, I can do math. It's five to glance. We had a glance. Um, three up jink because of night shields. Good. All right, so both pieces over here into my raider. So we'll do Harold's first. He hits on a two. It's, and then everybody else hits on a three. Might as well do them all together. Then we got three. Three sixes will wreck me. Uh, I really need you not to get these three sixes. Good they did not jink. So six is a glance. No, uh, no damage. The blood claws are going to assault my raider right here. Uh, the guys inside are going to overwatch. Seven guys left, six of them with rifles, rapid firing, hitting on through sixes. Twin link because of racks. 
There we go, we have four hits. Then the cannon has six shots hitting on sixes. Twin linked because of the racks for another two more hits. Wounding on fours. Two. Three up save. One dies. Seven inch charge still. I think it's like 55% of your. Is it 50 50 or 55? I, can't, I don't it's know. I think it's straight 50, isn't it? Is it straight 50? Okay. A decent chance of getting in. Oh, you make it with the eight. All right, now we're trying to hit the rear armor here. So starting with the wolf clock is the best chance to actually destroy it on his own. With rage, four attacks hitting my vehicle on three. Two hits, strength five, five is a glance. We got a pen. And what does it do? Shaken. Blood claws, 36 attacks hitting on threes. That is a lot. Force. Oh yeah, your crappy weapon skill. Yeah. No, I want to skill one. You're hitting me on threes. Oh really? The vehicle. Oh true. Yeah. And looking for sixes to glance. It's it's oh you got it. It's super wrecked. I don't want to scratch my my paint job here, so I'm dropping a marker just to represent where the difficult train would be. Merge disembarking into only two inches, and they're not able to fit. So guys are gonna die. Not all the models could fit because they only rolled two for the difficult terrain, so one had to be removed as a casualty. I can't forget to do my test as well. Now we're good. And that ends turn two completely. So, scoring my two marker number fives. Two points for you. And I am not within three of marker number four. It's yours. And I've got a five as well. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Score four points this turn. Bring you a total of, I think, six. To my one. One, two, three, four, five, six, yes. And assassinate. No characters yet. Got one character hiding up here. Want to discard it? Discard it. Yeah. All right. So my turn, turn three. Does my razor wing come on? It does. My three new cards, demolition, we discard that. Marker number six. That's 14, I'll look that one up. And marker number one. Marker one. Marker six. And 14 for the Dark Eldar is no escape. Kill one unit, oh sorry, have one enemy unit that was, <laughs> make one of my opponents unit fall back, or kill something with stealth or shrouded. Nothing has stealth or shrouded, so I gotta make somebody fill a morale test basically. We're rallying over here. Yeah, I don't know. They're good, true born our leadership nine. I forgot to follow these guys back before. They would have failed. So they would go back eight, Whew, 13 inches. Backwards? Yeah, head this way away from stuff. And then I'm gonna see if I can rally them. Yeah, they rally. I'm going to, I actually have no idea what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna move forward on my regroup. A one razor wing flying over here. This one's gonna fly off the table. My void raven's gonna fly that way off the table and it's gonna drop a bomb on his way down. Landing right here, scattering D6. Three inches that way. I'm waiting. Uh, I can't see. Nope. <laughs> and scatters the perfect angle to miss the land raider with that land shot. Only hitting three terminators, wounding them on twos. Three saves of five plus. In ball. Two dead? Two dead. All right, so we're gonna take this venom. Bring it to there. This one, just gonna pivot. My Ravager is gonna move 12 and get a dodge. Dodge is a very scary city. Want nothing to do with it. This Venom here is only gonna move six. Yeah. My Court of the Archon is gonna move through cover. Five inches. This Venom, just moving over. The Raider's gonna stay put. In my shooting phase, I'm gonna move my Ravager to be with max three inches from the objective. And it goes flat out. Uh, I don't wanna hurt my Ravager, so I'm gonna put my four missiles onto the head of uh, this guy over here. Left my Raider in the way. So, direct hit will get me two. First one is, oh. that's what we say, five inches that way. It just flips. So, oh, you. you're here. Go there. That's actually pretty ideal. Hitting five of the wolves. Yep. Second one. Direct hit. Two of them. 
third one uh, off the table. Fourth one, direct hit, two more of them, and that's all. Wounding the Thunder Cavalry? Are they called? Thunder Wolf, Thunder Wolf Cavalry. Wounding them on threes. Two with a three up save. Oh! Ooh, taking two wounds and killing one. And then we're wounding the dogs on twos. We got four. Hey, Pete. And it's gonna kill four dogs. It's not firing the dark lances into the Thunder Wolf. Nothing. Snap firing the cannon, the splinter cannon, into the Thunder Wolf. Three hits. Wounding them on fours. Two wounds. Three up save. Five. We're good. Rapid fire, snap fire into the dogs here. No hits. Snap fire into the uh, murder fang with the dark lance. Misses. Firing the dark lance. Murder fang. Hit on a three. Uh, glancing on a four. Nothing. Squad inside is gonna rapid fire their rifles into the dogs. Scratch that, I'm going to the Thunder Wolves. 18 rifle shots hitting on threes. Hey! Whoa! Whoa. 13 shots with 10 ones. Or 18 shots with 10 ones. Twin link because of the racks. Winning on fours. Three up saves. Taking two wounds. Kills another one. With the cannon, six shots hitting on threes. They all hit. They're wounding on fours. Oh, only one wound. Three up save. Good. My cavalry's on the ground over here, and I rapid fire their weapons into the blood claws. Hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. Three up armor save. One dies. This venom is going to fire its uh, squad inside onto the blood things. Standing right here. Trying to anyway. Going back. Looks like four inches. Hitting nothing. The second one, direct hit. That one gets six. The third one, oh, is going this way. Hitting one of my Cabalites. And the last one, direct hit. Yep. Hey, one so, on you. Yeah, 12 on the Blood Fangs. Claws? Claws. Claws. <laughs> and one of my guys. Let's do my guy wounding on a two. And five up, uh, close to the model will be five up cover. And five up, feel no pain. You good. Feel no pain, what am I thinking? It's strength six. 12 wounds on the blood claws. Wounding on twos with shred. 12 saves, three up. Three will die. Oh, one. One, just <laughs> one. And the last guy will rapid fire his rifle, hitting on threes. Wounding on fours for one more save. All good. Three slith are in range to fire their carbines, so I'm gonna fire them. Nine shots hitting on threes. Wooding on fours. Three more saves. One more dies. There's Venom. I'm gonna fire into him. Twelve shots from the Venom hitting on threes. Wooding on threes. Four, it's only thinking threes. Four saves of three up. You gave me two saves, so two more die. There goes the fist. This is Venom down here. It, the Venom itself is going to fire two cannons into the blood claws. Hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. Yeah. Oh no, why can't I make wounds? Three up save. Oh, oh, oh just one. It's unlucky dice. One more, one more. Nah, just one dies. Squad in size and a fire it's blaster into the Terminators. Hitting on threes. Wounding on twos. Five up and vulnerable save. Ooh, makes the invulnerable. The four <laughs> rifles inside, hitting on threes. Wounding the Terminators on fours. Four, two more saves, a two up. This is the one I will fast. This is, this is where, not even. <laughs> the Venom from the Trueborn squad. I, I gotta take out uh, Terminators. Ooh. Uh, hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. Ah, uh, two saves, two up. No. Oh. Ooh. And that gets the flamer. At least I got him down. So we have this squad left, including its venom, and that's all I got. So we're gonna put the cannons uh, into. They owe you a test as well. They're leadership nine. Ten. Ten. Harold. 
And they're gonna be ten as well. Gonna be ten because they're within Herald. Hmm. Who are you guys gonna fire at? We're going into the Thunderwolf Cavalry. Hitting on threes. Hmm. Wounding on fours. We got three. Even distance, putting one on the regular guy and two on Harold there. So on the regular guy, he's good. Two on Harold. He takes a wound. Guys inside the squad here. Gonna fire into the blood cloth some more. Blasters hitting on two threes. Wounds on twos. That's gonna kill one. And four rifles hitting on threes. Wounding the blood cloths on fours. Three more saves on them. Of three up. Two more go down. That's all my shooting. So we have a bunch of tests. Let's start <laughs> off with the Terminators. Turn this side of the table. Leadership nine. That's totally good. Blood claws. Leadership nine. Good. Just. Ten. Holes. Ten because of their yep. range. Good. Nine. And. Harold himself. Yes, sir. He's fine. Good. And, and that's, that's everybody. <laughs> so at the end of my turn, I'm going to score marker six, marker one, and I'm going to discard. Kills something in the assault phase. Turn three for the space wolves. Does the flyer come on? I'm gonna jinx it. He's gonna it's never it's come never on. Come it on. never comes in. <laughs> I'm gonna, it, yeah! It's on! Oh, I do my jinx dance. You roll too fast. <laughs> three new cards for the space wolves. Secure objective two. I think that's our side. Well, I'm not sure where that is. Where is number two? Oh, I think I'm holding it. I'm oh, holding it. There. With <laughs> objective secured. And death of vengeance. Tactical objective is generated. Your opponent must nominate one of its characters from his army roster. Score one victory point at the end of the phase. The chosen character has been removed as a casualty during this or the pre previous turn. I have to choose my only character. The guy okay. up there. That's all right. And one more. Hunt with cunning. Score one victory point at the end of your turn. If at least one enemy unit was completely destroyed by a space wolf unit, with the scout infiltrate or outflank special rules. Ooh. Those are my wolves if they can hit your transport. So yeah, I mean right here you have uh, two outflankers. And nothing else that could possibly score it, right? If at least one enemy unit was completely destroyed by a special unit with scout infantry out special rules during the same turn, that it arrived from reserves, score D3 victory points instead. And we got Underdog flying in over here. The Grey Hunters are going to move into the Rhino, or Rhino <laughs> land right here. Marine <laughs> Priest is going to move off the objective a little bit. He's moving full six if he likes. Shoot some things. Terminators are coming to terminate. Blood Claws getting closer to my Cabalites. Overwatch is gonna... Uh, the Wolves are moving their beastly fast move to my Jet Bikes. And the Cavalry is going right for my Raider. Land Raider's gonna pivot and go beep, beep, beep. And then try to hide from my incoming Flyer. Switching in tactics, staying up front because he's not really gonna be able to hide from the Flyer very well. So keeping the guns on something. Change into here. Going on to the psychic phase, how many warp charges are we getting? Ooh, I got six. Manifesting living lightning first. Needing one. Get getting it with one. I need to stop that particular spell, so I'm using everything on it. Hey, I stopped it. Casting Fury the Wolf Spurts next. Uh, do I use all five? More chances, 50, ah, oh, one, I don't care. To oh, you don't even get it. I don't even get it. Whoa, end of the psychic phase. Pistols into my... Raider. Raider. I'm gonna jink because he's gonna assault it anyway. Might as well. Two hits. Six is a glance. Oh, 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 good thing I jinxed. Made both jinx. Single bolt pistol into my cavalry. Hitting on a three. Wounding on a three. Armor, but I get five up field of pain. Made it. Forgetting to move Murder Fang, but we, I knew what he was gonna do anyway, so we're gonna move him. He's gonna jump over that rack. He's gonna move six inches and get closer to my uh, Venom. So, I, we already discussed who's doing that before anyway. Flamer's now gonna flame the Venom. D6 hits. Templates also, oh, a better angle, also hit one of my Slith. So, first of all, we get D6 hits on the crew inside. And we're getting six. Wooding them on twos. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Ignores my Cowblade armor, but I will get Feel No Pain. And one dies. Uh, on a a one to four, it'll hit a regular guy, and a five hits my uh, my blaster, and a six I reroll. Regular guy. And wounding the slith on a four, uh, feel no pain. He felt that. I think that's my wounded guy. It is the wounded guy, so you take a death. Yoo -hoo. And the venom himself, glance on a five, nothing. 
Lander is gonna fire into the Venom. Um, what's gonna fire first? Uh, first. But I want to drink. I think that's dead anyway. Yeah, I'm not gonna drink. Hitting on threes and twin link. Yep. Glancing on six. We got one five up and vulnerable. Hey. Negative. Power the machine spirit into this venom here. He's gonna jink. Hitting on threes. Twin linked. Glancing on fours. Ooh. Let's Rending as well. No, they're automatic pens. Automatic yeah. Pens, yeah. So we're gonna jink the glance. Nope, it goes through. One hall point left. And we're gonna jink those pens. We drink them both. Single shot from the Hellfrost Destructor hitting me on a three on my Ravager. Oh, it rolls a one. And the one use only missiles, uh, what are they called? The Stormstrike missiles. Stormstrike missiles. Two of them hitting my Ravager on threes. Two hits. Their strength eight, armor 11, threes a glance. We got a glance and a pen. Let's jink the glance. Let's jink the pen. Oh, the pen goes through. Open topped AP2. Plus two to the chart. Yes. Five plus explodes. Mm. Oh, shaken. That's fine. Then the heavy bolter. So one's gonna fire a full ballistic skill, and the other's gonna snap fire. Can I pass? With power the machine sphere, they're both gonna fire a full ballistic skill. So six shots hit my Ravager on threes. Are they twin linked? They are in fact twin linked. Reroll those ones. For two more hits. Six is the glance. Armor 11 on the Ravager. Just need one six. And you knock him out. Oh, oh, we got two. You have three. Three up, Jink. It's super dead. <laughs> and that ends the shooting phase. We're going on to the assault phase. Who wants to try first? I'm going to be sneaky. And I'm going to declare. Um, ah, it's a nine inch charge plus the difficult train of my wrecked vehicle there. So looking for an 11 to make the charge. I'm not going to overwatch. And I'm going to throw the camera out the window. <laughs> if you roll 11. <laughs> good, we're good. Fill charge. Uh, blood Claws and Clara Charge, I will overwatch. Uh, rifles, Twin Link hitting on sixes. Wounding on fours. We got one save for the Blood Claws at three up. Good. When I said Twin Link, what I meant to say is the rapid firing. <laughs> okay, and then the Splinter Cannon hitting on sixes for one, wounding on a four. One more save at three up. All good. I roll, you can just go like, blah, you're in. What double ones? Yeah, you're more than an inch away. You were an inch away from me. Okay. Good, yeah. <laughs> Bulls are gonna charge my Reavers. They're gonna Overwatch with their rifles, hitting on sixes. Nothing. And they're gonna be able to roll. See how far you can wrap around. Thunderwolf cover into my. Oh, you're super in. <laughs> into my Raider. They're gonna Overwatch on the inside first. Rifles rapid fire hitting on six. Twin link because of racks. Ooh, lots of hits. And then the cannon. Ten sitting on sixes, and it's twin link because of the splinter racks. Wounding Thunderworth Cavalry on four plus. Wow. That's a lot of three up saves to make. Three up armor saves for those cavalry. Can we get them? I was gonna cut it afterwards. Yep. You take what one wound. wound and putting it on Harold himself. I could have. Oh, he, two wins? Yeah, you can put yeah, it on him. Two Actually, wins. yeah, that makes sense. Two wins. Putting it on the regular guy because they're two wounds apiece. So he's done one wound and Harold's on the two. Murder fangs and assault my venom and the crew inside and fire their blaster. Hitting on the six. No. Charging in, I think double. No, you can't possibly fail. I got bam. Five. Blood guys going first. I'm zippy fast, so I'll attack first. My five cabalites hitting the blood claws on threes. Yeah. And wounding on fives. Two wounds. Three up save for the blood claws. One dies. Yoink. Four attacks on the pack leader back onto my... Oh, you know what? Hmm. What's his weapon skill? Three. Oh, no. Pack Your majority would have been the higher one. I have to check the clips. Put the, put the, I'm going to put the guy back. I'm just going to re-roll that. I, I was incorrect. The majority weapon skill would have been a four, so I would have hit them on fours. So instead of just figuring out what it would have been randomizing. I'm just gonna re-roll the whole thing. So I have five attacks hitting on fours. We have two hits wounding on fives. Nothing. So we're gonna go on to have the attack now. So we'll do the power class first. 
Because why not? Normal guy. Normal guy first? Okay. So he has four attacks on the charge, hitting me on fours. Two hits, wounding me, uh, strength four. Strength four. Wounding me on threes. Nothing. Nothing. Then the power claws, or wolf force. claws. He's hitting me on fours. Fours, fours, yeah. Your strength five from me on twos. With shred. Yeah. Ooh. Thank you. Okay, ignores my armor, but I got feel no pain against that. Nope, I lose two guys. Yoink. Yoink. And whoop, whoop, whoop. I lose combat by two over there. So leadership down to six. And we're gonna flee. Initial roll off, I'm five plus, I'm 10. Six to catch me. <laughs> No, I get away. So how far am I going to go? I'm going to run eight inches. Going over here, again, I'm zipping fast with my initiative seven guy. So two attacks apiece, four attacks hitting the wolves. Hitting the dogs on fours. Wounding the dogs on fives. Hey, two wounds. Ooh, six up. Six up armor save. Two die. Bam. 15 attacks back on my bikes, hitting on fours. With furious charge, wounding me on freeze. Oh, Ooh! Wow. <laughs> I'm gonna win this fight, I think. Five up armor. Five up feel no pain. I need to make one of these. Yes! One guy's gonna die. We're gonna kill. Oh, I think this is easier to get out. Stubborn using Harold's leadership here of 10, so leadership 10 to stay, and they're staying. Uh, I'm hitting running out of there. On a six, I can't run away. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go straight. Actually, I'm gonna go that way. Aiming kind of towards the librarian. 11 attacks to the, from these two guys with frost axes hitting my raider on threes. Glancing my raiders on threes. Oops. Okay, we have three pens. Open top, maybe two. Yep, could explode. Well, three of those, <laughs> and it does not explode. My guys are going to go into the cover. Three inches, and a leadership test. Uh, not good. Okay, over to Murder Fang. Um, I don't know. You have a bunch of attacks, don't you? Yeah. Murder Fang has seven attacks on the charge, hitting my venom on threes. Ooh, three hits. Maps are crafted, so we'll get to reroll one of those for another hit. The Furious Charge, wounding or glancing on twos. We got three pens. Five up and vulnerable save. Nope, take them all. Three dice, um, AP two and open top. It blows up on a five, it blows up. So, how many inches to blow up? Oh. Six inches. It's going to hurt this squad over here. So it gets one guy wounding on oh, two, uh, two guys, uh, three guys, three guys, wounding them on fives. Very tough. There's still five for them. Four. We got one. Uh, let's put it on the closest model, which is uh, five of armor. Made it. The five guys inside can be wounded on threes. We got two, five of armor, five up. Feel no pain. Lose one guy. Uh, on a five, it's the blaster. On a six, I reroll. Nope, not the blaster. So that ends turn three. Are you scoring anything, sir? Secure objective two. Um, I'm on it. It's my objective. You did kill something with that one card you have. Uh, you uh, hunt with cunning score one victory point coming from outflank. Yes, so one victory point. For yep. And then discarding oath of vengeance killed my character, so I'm gonna keep hiding. Going on to turn four, all my guys getting fearless and get up where they stand. Uh, I draw three new cards. First card's gonna be marker, or sorry, number 15, I looked that one up. Ah, 13, I looked that one up. 55, make you fail a morale, fear, or pinning test. Number 13 there is death by a thousand cuts. Score one victory point of at least one casualty was caused by three different enemy units. Not, I have to do a casualty to three different enemy, enemy units. And my other one, pain in all its forms. Score one victory point if at least one unit was completely destroyed in the assault or shooting phase. And score D3 victory points if a unit was destroyed in your assault and shooting phase. If three enemy units were completely destroyed in either of the phase combined, 
is D3 plus 3. Bomber's coming up over here, Razor Wing's coming over here, and this Razor Wing, pre-measured this, it's coming over here. Yeah, okay. You're laughing at me. I haven't, I haven't started, like, I haven't started, I haven't started. Oh. <laughs> oh, it is. Yeah, it's going, I heard a beep. <laughs> Jake's laughing at me because I'm just, I'm just trying to like calculate how to get max amount of victory points this turn. So I drew like a really perfect card at this time. I didn't know this card existed, but I can potentially get a lot of victory points by just spreading out my damage. So... What are you thinking? What are you thinking? <sighs> okay. So I need to kill at least three different units combined in the shooting or assault phase. There's two, the unit plus the character. Here's two, the unit plus the character. Um... Wolf. Oh! Terminator Wolf. I only, need, I only need three. Why am I counting six? Yeah, no. You only need three. Huh. So you need to that's... You got one, two, three. There's a four. Oh, this should be easy. Character, that's not a character, that's a leader. Oh, he's not actual... But the Rune Priest behind him over there. Ooh, that's gonna change my thinking then. Okay, so... Yeah, he's trying to kill everything, I think. Just all the guys. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. First thing in my movement phase, I'm gonna see if this guy gets immobilized. They even get a better line of sight. So, does he get immobilized? No, he's good. Alright, so I'm gonna tweak the position of... Oh, my Trueborn. This one's gonna move just to the edge. They're gonna stay put. Move through cover for the guys down there, or move through the terrain. Four inches. <laughs> Jet bike is gonna come to here, and he's gonna decide what he's gonna fire at and charge later. Stay in put, stay in put. And this squad here is gonna move through difficult terrain, five inches. Shooting phase, I'm gonna start off with the Void Raven bomber. He's gonna put his two dark lances onto those terminators. Scratch that, he's going first. He's putting his dark, uh, dark, dark lances on the terminators. He's not gonna fire yet. So Dark Lance from the Ravager, hitting on threes, wounding on twos. Oh no, one five up save. Nope. Oh, kills one. And then it's Splinter Cannon, hitting on threes, wounding on fours. Two, two up saves. Can he stay alive? No, no! double one. Whew. Moving over to this flyer, I'm gonna fire my two dark lances into the flyer. Do you want a jink? You're getting red. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you need a jink? Okay. Two shots hitting on threes. Glancing on fours. Nothing! Nothing for no one. The squad with the slith are gonna fire their weapons into that squad of blood claws. Four shard car carbines hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. We have four, four, three up saves. One oh, dies. Nice. Snap fire the two splinter cannons into the rune priest. And I can't even see through my own ship, so I actually can't see him. So let's snap fire into the lone little guy down there. Hitting on sixes. Hey! This actually gonna be better for me. <laughs> Wounding on fours. Three more saves should get him. One. Oh, no. Two. Why, oh. why are you torturing me? Oh. Ah, he's still good. A rifle from the squad inside is going to fire into him. Hitting. I, I think I'm in rapid fire range, actually. Hitting two shots, rapid fire, hitting on threes. Winning on fours. Make another save. Yay. He's still good. Okay, I didn't want to do this, but I got to fire the small blast onto his head. So the first one's going to be. Two inches that way, three inches that way. Hit. Three inches and misses. The next one, uh, six inches. is, is going to be two inches. Oh, that should hit. Misses. The third one hits. <laughs> the fourth one. Oh. Oh no. Oh, it's actually going this way. More to your drop pod. So it's going to go eight inches in just the drop pod. Yep. So glance the drop pod in the six. Oh. oh. Wow. We glance the drop pod, and we're going to wound him What's on a two. No AP, so three up save. Can he, can he keep tanking all these? He's the man. He's gotta die eventually. Ah! Up on top, they could explode in the six. Oh, it explodes! Oh! How far does it go? Four inches and hit all three of those guys. I <laughs> Wounding on threes. Yes! Oh no, no, no. Five up armor. Five up film of pain. No, there goes my cannon. There goes my cannon. This squad. Isn't a fire into him. 
First the Dark Lance. He's gonna get the Dark Lance, he's gonna do it. Hitting on a three. Hooning on a two. He's dead. Get him out of the table. <laughs> Throw him in the garbage. Did he call? No, that's my wreck for the. Ah. Then I'm gonna fire his two cannons onto the Rune Priest. If he's in range. Very much in range. Hitting on threes. Four hits, wounding on fours. Oh, we have four wounds at least. Three up stage for his last wound. Doing it one at a time. He's just like to hurt me. <laughs> He's still alive, he's dead! Squad inside and for the blaster onto Murder Fang, hitting on threes, misses. That squad is gonna fire on Murder Fang, hitting on threes, misses with the blaster. Rapid fire into the dogs. Actually, we're gonna start over here, we're gonna use the, hmm, squad inside, he's gonna fire first. First the blaster, hitting on a two, or three, and misses. Rifles inside, hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. For two wounds on the dogs. Ah, uh, TP5. This squad's gonna rapid fire into the... Dogs. No. <laughs> Thunderwolf Cavalry. 19 rifle shots, hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. Three up armor saves for the Thunderwolf Cavalry. Two wounds. And the cannon fires, six shots, hitting on threes. Ooh. Wounding on fours. Two more three up saves to make. We knock him out. He's good. Rifle, rapid fire. Hitting on threes. Wounding on fours. Nothing. Yay! Blaster, Land Raider. Hitting on threes. Yay! Hey! And I'm a flyer. Nothing left from the shoot at, so he's gonna go flat out. And. Hmm. No. And he's gonna turn and just zoom off the table and get out of here. But I'm not exactly sure about something. I don't know if I can come on the table and fly off the same turn. So I'll just stop right here, uh, just in case, because I really don't know what I can do. So I'll stop right there and leave him there. We have a couple of morale tests to make over here. A little 10 for the dogs. Good. 10 for... He's, he's good. So Psychological Warfare, I'm actually gonna discard it at the end of the turn because I can't, I'll never score that. Scoring Jake's marker number two. Add into my pile. And I think I'm scoring both of these. For death by a thousand cuts, I killed, I took ca six different units to casualties for D3 victory points. Let's count those again. Yep. So, this unit of Thunderwolf Cavalry, Plus one. one, two for the Hounds. Drop Pod. Drop Pod is three. Both Blood, Blood Claws are four, five for the Terminators, and, and six for the Librarian. So that's worth D3. Two. two. And I'm also scoring Pain in all its forms. It's worth D3 plus three. What was that one for? The for, ooh, six points, a big swing. That was for completely destroying three units combined yep. in my shooting or assault phase. Getting myself six points off of just one card was a big swing, giving me 12 victory points to Jake's current seven. What was it for that one card you still would have had the lead? One big swing. Six, yeah. So that does end turn four. Oh, no, was. no, sorry, that's oh. my turn four, going into your turn four. Yep. So we're drawing three new cards. Witch Hunter, you don't Slay, have- yep. Closet. Supremacy, D3 victory points if you control two objective markers and twice as much as you, but I don't I think- I don't think you can possibly get that one. Uh, overwhelming firepower, yeah, if your unit was completely cool. destroyed in the shooting phase. I do have a lone cabalite. <laughs> you can just throw- That's a, I might as well just go for points. Oh, the wolves might get him. Oh, shooting phase. Shooting phase, yeah. Mm. Well, you have power of the machine spirit and you have a heavy flamer. I have a heavy flamer. But it's I can't hard. heavy flame all of them. True. Um, we'll think about it. And some secure, secure objective five again over in the. Oh, Ooh. you already got her with your land raider. In the movement phase, murder fangs like nope. I'm going this way now. Harold is getting moving through terrain, going over my wreck and getting close to my cabalites. The dogs do the same thing, getting an inch away. Plenty to do so. Pivoting of the land raider. Dropping down to hover and moving the flyer towards my cabalites. Murder Fang's gonna throw his flamer at this lone cabalite. Can you hit any others by chance? Nah, it's just up. Yeah, you can get, uh, you're not. yeah, you can get him. So you can hit him on a two, you wound him. To ignore my armor. But I will get Phil No Pain of five up. Oh, he goes down. That's your first unit killed in the shooting phase. And the other guy on a two. Wound him. He has still no pain. Oh, he's good. Yeah. Shot from Harold there. Hitting my tablets on twos, or threes, and then, and then wounding on threes. Ignores my armor, but I got myself some five up cover. Made it. 
Backing up a step, he has one more gun. So he put it, he, his flamer targeted this unit and hit this guy as well. So now his storm bolt is also gonna fire on this unit as well. Hitting on threes, wounding on twos. Five up cover. Okay. <laughs> Both hurricane bolters gonna fire onto my jet bike. He's gonna jink. Well, shot hitting on threes. Twin linked. Thank you. You're gonna need some extra hits. He's the super jinky guy, I think. Yeah. Hold on, <laughs> please. Uh. Not bad, not bad. Wounding on fours. Lots of wounds. Uh, three up jink save. Five up, feel no pain. Oh. He's in nine! Ah. And the assault cannons are trying to fill him, finish him off. No feel no pain against this thing though, because it is strength six, so hitting on threes. Everything hit. Who wounding on twos? All I got is my three up jink. No, you get him. Power the machine spirit starting with on the flyer to throw his dispersed blast onto my cabalites. Meaning for that guy's head right there, direct hit will get all four of them plus one of my slith. So, where's the scatter die? Oh, need a direct hit. Need a direct hit. Need a direct hit. That's a direct That's hit. That's a direct hit. That's a direct hit. Four of those cavalites are hit, wounding on twos, any ones, and I think I win this game. <laughs> no! Yes. No, I can't even go to ground. Oh, I got, <laughs> I got cover. No, it's a template. Five up cover for the first two guys. No, that's a crater. Six up cover for the first two guys. They're, no, oh, one's alive! One's alive! So, he dies, my blaster dies. Uh, my next, that's two of the five. Six up cover again. He's dead. I'm gonna take him away. Then the next guy just dies. The last guy there has a five up cover. He dies. Wait, there was way too. No, no, he's alive. Too many guys. And the slith. You wound him on a three. Wounded. Uh, I think the first one's not in cover. Nope. So the first one's not in cover. Feel no pain. All he gets. He felt no pain. Six shots from the heavy boulders, twin links, snap firing on that lone cabalite, hitting them on three, it's hitting on sixes. Twin linked. Two more. <laughs> you need, two you more. need a couple more here. Two more. You got oh. your two more. <laughs> okay, you're wounding me on twos. All three. Thank you. You got them all, okay, okay, <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna get five up cover. Oh! Five of Phil no pain. <laughs> you need him dead, don't you? You need him for your point. Nothing else can shoot. Nothing else can shoot. Nothing you need, can you shoot. need this point. I, you know what? I'm going to make you stew for a bit. I'm, I'm going to practice rolling this die. Practice? <laughs> I need more practice! <laughs> and there he goes. This man was sweating in here. Oh, that is awesome. You are going to score your points, sir. Going on to the assault phase, murder phase, and clear assault on my cabalites. I can't overwatch. So you can roll it. No, definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> See if he makes it in. He's minus two for cover. What do you got there? It's eight. Eight. So ten. Looking for tens to get in. Nah, he's not in. No. Then the dogs are gonna clear, and I'm going to Overwatch. <laughs> Rapid fire all those. Rapid fire all the rifles, and I included the cannon here as well. Hit the dogs, or yeah, hitting the dogs on sixes. Just three. Wounding them on fours. Two saves of five up for being on the train. Cover saves. One. One dog dies. And then they're automatically in. And do you want to charge in two? Yeah, I'll charge in two. Brr. Unwieldy and charging through terrain here, so my guy's pile and attack first. So I'm gonna put these five on the dogs and the other five on to Harold there. Hitting the dogs on fours. Crap. <laughs> <laughs> Hooning the dogs on fives. Hey, six up save. You dead. Hitting Harold on four. Wounding Harold on six. One. Oh. Three up save. <laughs> this is. This has <laughs> just been. I need a heart doctor after this game. Yeah, yeah, He's yeah. good. Dog first. Hitting me on fours. Two hits. Strength Wounding off. me on twos. Two wounds. Five up armor. Five up feel no pain. You kill one, I'm gonna pull this guy. And Harold. Forgot through the Hammer of Wrath from the Thunder Wolf, so it hits me on a, probably a three. Misses. <laughs> now the ax hitting me on threes. I'm assuming your weapon skill at least five, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Threes to hit. Whew, Mastercrafted. 
That's the ground. <laughs> okay. And these are wounding on twos. Oh, that means four are dead. No feel no pain. I lose the combat by four, but I'm fearless, so we're just gonna hang on. Well, at the end of turn four, what's happening? So objective five is secured by my land raider. You got her. So that goes me up to eight. Uh, score one victory point if an enemy unit was completely destroyed in the shooting phase. You did. I get D3 if it's three or more. <laughs> if you roll a three, here you go. <laughs> you roll a three, we're tied. No, no, I've only got up to 11. I can do math. <laughs> oh! <laughs> no! Oh no! And you're not scoring supremacy. Uh, that's going away. At the end of turn four, the score is 12 11. Turn five for the Dark Eldar. Two cards. Marker number four. Marker number two. I love these. I love these. An ascendancy. That'll help. Two I have. It's underneath. Harold there, I'm up there for security. If they survive, he's dead. Yeah, well, I'm gonna send somebody else over there. Uh, marker number four, where are you? Where are you? Marker number four. Oh, is that the one back there? That's six. Three, Which four? five. Is that Wait a minute. I'm missing an objective. Oh, it's that. <laughs> yeah, I really did that one as well. Okay. Uh, and then ascendancy, control any three objective markers. Not gonna be a problem. One. In my movement phase, this flyer and that flyer are gonna fly off the table. I'm gonna take uh, this boy and turn him and fly him to there. Guys inside this venom are gonna get out and disembark. And then it's gonna move 12 inches this way. The trueborn are gonna get out now from their raider or their venom. And then the venom's gonna take off. Lights in here are gonna get out. And then it's gonna jump to here. My Archon, Court of the Archon's gonna move through difficult terrain and go nowhere. They're gonna stay right there. Shooting phase, I gotta go flat out a couple of things. So first of all, he's gonna go there. Stay on the objective. He is gonna go like that. They're gonna fire into the flyer that's hovering you on a jink. One shot from a blaster, strength 8 AP2, Lance. Lance won't matter, I guess. It'll be like your moment with losing thing. I am not gonna jink. Not gonna jink. Not gonna jink. Okay. Hit another three. He's gonna do now. Still don't want to drink? I was supposed jinking, I get power machine spirit, I still get one. That is true. It is true. And snap wearing twin heavy boulders isn't terrible. Isn't terrible? Yeah, jink, man. Yeah, yeah okay. I'll, I'll jink. The next blaster hits. Glance is on a four. Pens! Jink! Four of Jink save! 50 50. I think I'll blow him up, so. Whew. Buy a lot of ticket now. Being stunned yet? Yes! Dark Lance in the murder fang. Hitting on a three. Glancing on a four. Nothing. Alright, blasters in the murder fang. Rear armor. Alright, my trueborn are gonna scatter on themselves and kill themselves. Maybe, maybe. Did you put it on the far end or? Uh, yeah, as far that way as I can. Okay. First one. Misses. Second one. Misses. No, maybe not. Five. Moving over two inches. Oh, two. Three inches. It's yeah, gonna get him. Still get him. Third one hits, and the last one misses. Yeah. Not enough to kill him. So we're looking for fours to glance. Got a pen in a glance. No cover through the pen does. Shake him. But Down to one hull point. Two dark glances into the land raider. Hitting on threes. Oh, Jake. Who <laughs> wounding, on, glancing on fours. There's a pen. Can we blow it up? Can we blow it up? I want a six. I'll take it immobilized. All right, going over here, we have this combat. I want to put three attacks into the dog. Yeah, three in the dog and two in the herald. <laughs> so, the dog, hitting them on fours. Wounding them on fives. Nothing. Herald, fours. Ooh. Sixes, oh. Ooh, three up, oh. he's dead, he's dead. It's someone's life, you're taking someone's life. It is a person. Dog attacks back, hitting on fours, wounding on threes. Doesn't have fury charge anymore. Two wounds and five up save. Five up feel no pain. Hey, tight combat. <laughs> so I score, marker number two, marker number four, and ascendancy. Ascendancy's worth D3. 
Game worth game three. <laughs> Big deal. So he has these three cards. It's worth six points this turn. Turn five for Space Wolves. Can you get three really good cards? Unleash the wolves. Score one victory point if you control if at least one enemy unit was destroyed in the assault phase. Doable. You have guys still in the land raider. You can kill my venom. You can kill my venom. It's a long way away. It's gonna be a long charge to yeah. terrain. Uh, second. Oh yeah, murder fang here too. Oh, it could do. You could definitely do stuff. Uh, if this mission has mysterious objectives. No. Nope. Discard it. Stuff of Saga, so one victory point at the end of your turn if at least one enemy vehicle or monstrous creature was destroyed. If I kill three, that's D3. Definitely doable. Oh boy. A vehicle. They're weak. can go at the, yeah. Whoo. So Q objective two. Two. Which you got. Well, number two is over it's here, but I'm going to control it because I yeah, have yeah, the secured. Yeah. Murder things that crawl over my broken raider. He moves six inches. And staying in hover mode, we're going to take underdog here and try to kill my, my general. My warlord. Flamer is gonna hit the venom over here, so automatically hits. I uh, glance on a five. There's a pen. I have a five up invulnerable. I make it. Then you have Storm Bolter, two shots hitting on threes. Who glancing on sixes? Who five up invulnerable? Nope, take a hull point. Nah, I'm a bad. This is his hull point over here. He's dead. Hurricane Bolter over here, a fire on the flyer, hitting on sixes. I'm jinking. Twin linked, one hit so far. Two hits, glancing on sixes. Nothing. Assault cans to go for it now. Four shots hitting on sixes. Two hits so far, twin linked. Oh. Three hits, oh no. Glancing on fours. We got a single pen. Three up jink. No! <laughs> um, I don't think it can hurt anything when it falls. Can't, you can glance him on a six if it falls this way, so I'll roll it. Let's see which way you're gonna fall. Nah, you're hitting nobody. Power of the machine spirit, the other hurricane bolt, or the venom over here, hitting on six, threes. I'm jinking. We got three hits, glancing on sixes. We got a glance. Give me a, there you go. Nope, oh, I'm a four jink. Take a whole point, done a one. Using power of the machine spirit, we're throwing the large blast right here. Uh, strength 6 AP2? Yes. Oh boy. All right, let's see if you can be scattered back on yourself. <laughs> Don't get a direct hit. Don't get a direct hit. Get a direct hit. hit. I want it. Hit. I want it. Don't get hit. This is your general? This is my general. He's yeah. right there. My warlord. Oh. oh no. Oh no. That's all five. All right. Wounding on twos. Oh no. This is going to kill him. I know it's going to Oh. One's gonna survive. So that's gonna kill four guys. I'm gonna make four lookout sirs because he's the closest. I almost made four lookout sirs. That is warlord kill. And snap fire the bolters, the, the bolt guns, heavy bolters, that's what they're called. Six shots, hitting on sixes. Two hits, twin linked. Ooh, we got two hits. Wounding on twos. Two wounds, ignores my armor, but I feel no pain. Oh, five up. Now nah, he's dead. So going on to the assault phase here, I got four Cabalites attacking that dog, hitting him on fours. We're wounding him on fives. Nope, attack back, two attacks hitting on fours. Wounding on threes. There's a wound, five up armor. <laughs> Made ah. armor. That's gonna end at turn five, so we're going on to, ooh, how many points you score? Um, Secure objective two. You don't. Nope, I still have her. And that can go to you. On my next turn. next turn. Yep. If it happens. Score one victory point at the end of the turn if at least one enemy unit was completely destroyed during your assault phase. No. Didn't happen. So that didn't happen. Uh, score one victory point if at least one vehicle or monstrous creature was destroyed. You definitely did that. I got that one. So it so goes to, to 13. 13. And that's plus the wall of kill as well. I've added that already. If I can. Oh, it's a 12 sided die, so I'm looking for 13. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so at the end of turn five, it's 18 13. to 13. I hit two big spikes of cards. Uh, I'm very whittled down, as are you. Yeah. Are we going on the turn six? It'll be interesting. I don't like my chance, but the big fly, you got two more flyers coming I in. Have, so no, I have, yes, I have two more flyers coming you're right. Flyers. I think I cannot catch you because your troop amount can get more objectives. This one's having objectives, so yeah. I don't think so. So if it ends, I'm happy with that. Oh, good. So. Uh, three plus, we go on turn six. Oh, do I concede? 
Yeah, I'll concede. Okay. Before <laughs> before you do that, let's just see what I would have got if I scour the skies. Eh, possibly, possibly. Uh, witch hunter. He's dead uh, already dead, so I can't discard it. And marker. Oh, that's a new. That's one of those dark elder ones. So it is something I can actually score. Um, good game. Very, very close, sir. Very, very yeah. fun. I enjoyed this one a lot. Uh, let's talk about this for a second. So I had one point where I scored six points from one card. From one card, and, and then the next like a, turn I scored. That's another D three, which you got two. So that's eight points. Yeah, no, I think it's, yeah, I scored and eight that turn. So nine points in one turn. Yeah, yeah, that was yeah. That's that's all my points here. The eighteen. That was half my points. Was gotten from yeah. one turn. Oddly enough, it was the cards that won me this game, not the tactics. Because, I mean, <laughs> I should have jinked my tantalus. <laughs> it still hurts. It still hurts. Uh, very good game, though. I don't know what... I, maybe I'll just drink more, but no, I wouldn't change anything. Would you do anything differently? Um, well, everyone did what they were supposed to. I think more bodies would have been nice. The Terminators didn't do much, so maybe that point cost to another troop unit. Maybe. Yeah, it tend to be a thing with Terminators. Either they tank it forever or they die doing nothing. No. Alright man, good game. Thanks for coming in. You were Thank awesome. You Guys, we're going to the vault and play another game. Probably not you because you're going home. Yeah, I'm going to go back to Australia tomorrow, so... But somebody else will be here. So if you will right now, click on the link below and get yourself a 7 day free trial for the next game in the vault. I will do some more Warhammer 40k. Thanks for watching, guys. And happy Wargaming.